This is uh, me, uh, Brad here, and as you can see, this is a Roblox, this is TF2, this is Minecraft, and I'm in creative mode right now, and I'm lagging terribly, and I don't make Minecraft videos because I lag out like this, but I want to get a Minecraft video out, and I thought, what better way to do it than do it with the first 1.7 snapshot out? This is, um, 13W36A, if I call. And, uh, it's, it adds in a lot of new volumes and stuff, and a lot of new, like, flowers, like, I open up my creative menu right now. I go right here into decoration blocks, a whole items in there, and some has changed, and there's a lot of new flowers in there, too. And if I scroll down, more the farther down you go. Right down here we got lilac and double tall grass and large ferns, rose bush, you know, peony, all this stuff. And you know, it's practically about it. They had new biomes and stuff. I know that they were gonna do some of the notion biome. And every YouTuber I've seen make a YouTube video on this yet. So it just kind of came out. I don't know if it's that today at the time of the recording. biome that I didn't even know they added in. On the on Mojang.com, they didn't really uh, say much about the biomes they added in. But it's a new biome, and uh, it's kind of useless, but they did make... Uh, I'll show you. See, if you look here, see I'm in deep ocean right now. And the entire ocean floor is covered in gravel, which I kind of found interesting. And I knew that they were gonna do something with the ocean, but I didn't know that they were gonna coat it in gravel. And, uh, I'm gonna go through this ocean area. I haven't found any hostile mobs, like, there that, you know, dinner bones thinking about. I would've truly liked to see sharks in this. And then in deep ocean biomes, randomly have, uh, on the very bottom have, like, a sunken ship. With, like, a shark spawner in it. Be, you know, an underwater dungeon, kind of. A lot of squids coming up. Again, I'm lagging. I have to turn everything down, so, uh... I think I'll pause recording right now, and... I forgot the shortcut to pause recording, so I'll just pause it. From Bandy Cam, and I'll come back when I'm ready. Alright, I'm back, and, uh... I found my... Well, it's not a new biome. It's a taiga biome. That's not covered in snow, and they added in something like this. Although, I believe that that was, uh... I don't know. It's either the red word, something like that. But, as you can see, this right here, this is called a large fern. If I place it down on the ground, it's kind of like that. It's sort of double what a normal fern would be. I'll just drop that. I don't need it anymore. And, uh... Yeah, dude, so that's one of the new things there. Also. Alright. Alright, yeah, that's okay. Alright, I feel like they retextured sugarcane. I don't think that sugarcane's supposed to look like... Seems like it's, uh... It's a fuller green, if that makes sense. I don't know, it's a weirder type of green. Hey guys, if you see all these chunk errors, you know, this is the whole reason why I don't really, you know, record Minecraft. And that's why I'm not going to do it very often. When I get a better computer, then, uh, maybe, and, you know, we'll take it from there. Uh, oh, wait, actually, now I see. I, I, I didn't even notice that was deep ocean until I got towards the bottom. And I realized that just the farther in you go, it says deep ocean. Huh. Well, that's cool, because I've never, because I haven't seen, like, a Minecrafter, you know, like a YouTuber, say anything about that. 
Yeah. And then again, I haven't really been searching too much for the, you know, 13W6 or 16A, I think it was. I'm forgetting. Oh man, dude, it's just forest. I thought it was going to be that thick forest there. That's going to be a cool biome. Some tightly naturally generated trees. I gotta try to do something about this, man. And I added in this new button here, and this it's called Super Secret Settings. Click it, it does nothing. You know? I turn a bunch of stuff off. I you know, turn on the brighten and everything, but you know, that's about it. Yeah, dude. I ain't gonna get nowhere with it. They added in a birch forest, which is, a uh, Here's some new stuff right here. Rose bush. It goes into two blocks, it looks like, but... Uh, yeah. The angle I'm punching it. Nope. Counts as two blocks, but, you know... Oh, is this a stone beach biome? Nope, I guess not. I was hoping that this is gonna be that there's stone beach. Is this like the new look of Extreme Hills? You know, like a stone cliff side? Cause I think that's just awesome. I did see a YouTuber, you know, flying over something that looked just like that, but it was actually titled, you know, mm. up there, Stone Beach. You know, I mean, again, yeah, that YouTuber was, uh, Jiminy Swift. But, uh, find another Taiga biome. I'll find a Redwood biome. 4x4 four four spruce trees. Awesome, some more large ferns I see down there. And also, just like double ferns, they have a uh, double, um, double, uh, double tall, tall grass, which, you know, you can find in, uh, plains biomes quite often. What I found out. But I do like this as a new extreme hells, just kind of stone. Right. Mm hmm. See, yeah. It's a poppy. Yeah. There, place it there. Can't place it there. And actually, the biome I spawned in. I'm not exactly sure how rare it is, because I mean, I haven't really been exploring that much. But, I. Do you know, you know, I've only run into one of them. Oh, there's a plains biome. Let's see if we can find any of that double tall grass. Oh, here it is, here it is, here it is. Right here. Double tall grass. You make yourself like a freaking maze out of this. Yeah. I just can't even see out of that, man. I'm lost. Uh, oh, no, I'm out. And right here is, uh, and here, these are daisies. I do, uh, oxide daisy. I think I'm just gonna go through and try to find a lot of these here. I might skip over good chunks of it, and I think right now is a good place to pause. And I'll be back. And I'm back, and I found myself, uh, that, uh, a new biome, and I did find a new plant along the way. The Azure, Azure Bluet. French, I think. Don't judge me. Uh, yeah, but this is a Mega Taiga biome, or Redwood biome. As you can see, this is just, you know, spruce wood. But they did add a new block down here. And that is Podzol, and it's only obtained through Silk Touch. Well, well you know, creative. Uh, yeah. 
Hey there, I'm back again, and, uh, yeah, I, I haven't, I haven't recorded in such a long time, uh, it's really starting to get, you know, weird, but, yeah, and I forgot that I have a 10 limit, 10 minute limit, I was going to buy it the other day, but something messed up on the card I was using, so, uh, I couldn't, so, I'm gonna have to wait until I can buy the actual full version of Bandicam, but this is a new thing that they added also, you know, they have a mossy cobblestone, as I was already implemented in the Minecraft. It's still, you know, you can only find it, in, you could only find it in dungeons previously. Now you can find it in Mega Tigas. Mega Tigas. And yeah, they're just giant... Spruce tre spruce trees, you know, and they're just covered by dirt and pods all, and it looks like they're kind of connected to normal tigers, cause, you know. Seems like this one's surrounded by a taiga biome. Also, I'm pretty sure some of the uh, ter like cave things are glitched, cause I found one. It Almost looked like a mini chunk error. It was only a three by three, but it was a perfect hole into the ground. And it went into a cave box system, but looks like these can actually go on and be pretty, pretty extensive. But if you're someone who likes spruce trees, then you'll enjoy that, I guess. You know, pumpkins and tiny biome there. And, uh, it's like I'll be back when I find a new biome. See ya. Alright, YouTube, I'm back. If, if you notice, this is Swamp Biome. But I feel like, I don't remember there being, like, so many, like, just, like, one-way passages of water. I feel like they're using just way too many freaking, you know, lily pads. I mean, look at this. That's completely coated in lily pads, you know? I feel like they added more lily pads to swamp biomes and everything. So, you know. I'm skeptical about that, but you know. I feel like they've changed that, that you know. Looks like they've changed sugar cane too. So, you know, they're keeping on adding updates, and I think I may be getting closer to a newer biome. And also, this is another thing right here. The grass. Even though it's still a swamp biome, the color of the grass is still changing. Which kind of confused me for a little bit. I like, I like the location of that right there. I feel like that's just kind of control from Minecraft. I feel like they've added in a lot more ocean, though. I don't think that there was this much ocean before. Are there that or the seed I'm using? It's kind of weird. And that's the seed I'm using, man. Extreme Hills. Apparently. Oh, this is an Extreme Hills Plus. I didn't know it's that plus. So, does that mean that normal extreme hills are the same, but plus are better, I guess? Extreme hills. Extreme hills, blah, blah, blah. So, extreme hills. I've actually really never found... Well, actually, I have once. What's up with this horse? It looks like he has bedrock on his back. This horse has bedrock on his back. Mm. He's got him. all his friends just have normal little, mm. are all the same. There's one guy looks the same except for his back, which is made of bedrock. I actually kind of want to quickly tame him. I do know a secret to taming these guys. Ooh, I see that they added in a different fish here. Cook salmon. Mm. Raw salmon, pufferfish, clownfish. Try fishing. Yeah, it's you. 
Tinam ta. You're supposed to. Came quicker. I don't think he's tamed yet, but I do want to grab a saddle. That's in transportation. Well, I think I'll look into transportation next. We see here. Where do you actually go? The black stallion. Kind of like the look of black horse. Better, but you know. Oh no, he is tamed. All right. Oh, he doesn't. He doesn't really have too much heart. Wow. I thought he would. Well, now I'm kind of disappointed. But still, man. I never thought I'd see the day when I see bedrock on a horse. Another plains volume. Even more horses. They're all white. No bedrock. In the forest. Saying that that was... Wow. I'm such an idiot. But yeah, alright. Not really finding too much different. Looks like, you know... Tiger biomes are extremely common now. And they now have an extreme lack of snow. And extreme hills biomes are also quite common from what it looks like. Those are probably the two most common enhanced biomes. What's this? Lilac. Lilac forest. Ha 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 ha. Oh, I'm lost. Okay, now I'm out. Alright. Well, I thought I was done with it. Oh, yeah, yeah. Thank you for dropping, finally. Well, I thought I was done with that. Oh, here we go. This is a new, this is a new biome right here. Birch forest. Oh, and that looks like it could be a savanna biome. From the distance, possibly. That tree looks weird. Oh, wait, no, that's a thick forest. Wow. Yeah, birch forest. This is exactly what I was talking about. And see, this is kind of what I'm talking about, though. I feel like, you know, Minecraft's kind of, you know, messing with me here in those holes, but yeah, it's a forest made of birch trees. Yep, this is a thick forest. Oh, my. Yeah, no, roofed forest. And as you can see, the forest with a giant freaking canopy on it, man. And they also have giant mushrooms! Oh my god, I love them so much! Now you can actually kind of find these, you know. In vanilla Minecraft, but this is one of the volumes that I really wanted to show off. Which I hadn't even found myself, you know, a, a forest. They don't just have red mushrooms, see, they have brown mushrooms too. They do their best of creating a giant canopy. And savanna biomes are somewhat the same idea behind it too, it's, you know. But they don't. They're not as thick, there's barely any trees, but the trees are kind of weird, they're sort of bent and stuff, kind of like the trees. Wow, this is a big, this is a big one. <sighs> I swear to turn large biomes. Ah, uh, from what I have seen that there, there is a new, uh, type of world generation, an amplified generation. I haven't actually tested it out myself because, I mean, my computer is awful. I could probably test it out if I wasn't recording. When I'm recording, I just, I don't know, there's just something up with, you know, my computer. 
Alright, sorry. Again with that. But yeah, my computer doesn't really want to run. So it looks like this might be in three to four parts, you know? Each of me kind of saying something and it cutting off in the middle of my speech. Thank you very much, Bandy Cam. I mean, you know, like, that's the thing. I'm trying to get. Ooh. Ooh. Surface lava. really kind of all I'm gonna really show you. I could go through all the flowers. It didn't look like they had an ultimate tools. Ooh, I like these. A... Luck of the C3, Lure 3. I'm gonna have to test that out. And when I do, I'll... I could actually make this video on me testing that out. Let me try it. I'm guessing that goes on a fishing rod, so get out. Lure 3, and, uh, look at the, oh, I know, that's, look at the C3, and I'll get out a fishing rod, and an anvil, And I'll rename it the fish catcher. I don't know, I spelled that wrong. Catcher. This is an expensive uh, fishing pole, but uh, let's test out this. Is this what I was talking about? Stone Beach. Stone Beach right here, man. Beach made of stone. There's a lot of, like, exposed iron and stuff. See, maybe it's best to be in an ocean or even a deep sea biome. Deep ocean. A deep ocean. Just wait here. That's a normal fish, alright. Raw fish. On Minecraft. I wanna see some of this, like, puffer fish and salmon and stuff. I think I'll be done with biomes and now we'll move on to fishing. And I'm gonna fish. I'm gonna catch one of each fish, alright? And you know, when I do. Then I'll probably move on to flowers, but as you can see, all the flowers are practically the same. You can kind of see them in my inventory. I've opened my inventory enough in these videos. You can look at them from there. Just pause the video and see what they look like. I know the hint of fishing, you know. You gotta be patient. I'm not patient. Come on, fishies. Fishies. I'm not gonna hurt you. I will miss it. I'm only going to catch you. Oh, I wanna see some of this. Huh? Come on. Who's a good lure? Who's a good lure? Mr. Bobber. Feather falling for protection three. You can catch enchanted books. That must have been luck of the sea. That must have been luck of the sea. Wow. Oh, here we go, here we go, that's raw salmon. Got my first fish. So I'm guessing lure? It's for, uh, catching better fish. 
And yeah. But there were two other fish that I saw. Food section. Yeah, there was uh puffer fish and clownfish. But there wasn't any cooked version of those. There is uh cooked salmon right there. So you can cook salmon. I've got the serving fish. If you can cook uh puffer fish, yeah. Should make it that puffer fish, like, you know how, like, in real life, you know, puffer fish are kind of dangerous if you don't prepare them correctly? That's why, like, it takes people years of training and stuff, you know, to really be able, you know, be hired at a restaurant that serves puffer fish, something like that, you know? Now, I'm thinking, you know, maybe have a chance that... Uh, maybe there's a slight chance that when you eat it, you'll be poisoned. Who knows? That'd be kind of cool, but very slight chance. You know? Oh, here we go. That's my puffer fish right here. And now we just need the clown fish. Mm -hmm. Like that fishing pole glitch right there. I don't, and I never really noticed them that bad until a s snapshot. Maybe it's a glitch in the snapshot. I don't know. That's whenever you do it too close to you, then it rises up out of the water. And you have a floating hook, you know? Hook and bobber. Messed up with my keyboard and pressing E to go. Oh, my hand back on the mouse. <laughs> Go off the mouse. I'm just like you can't fish it, man. Come on, fishies. So I do like this. They're making the fishing system more fun. I do like that. Oh, another salmon. Looks like clownfish can be kind of rare. Sam, in the second rare, I'm thinking that different fish can be called in different biomes. Like, normal fish in any biome, maybe puffer fish in deep ocean. You know, salmon in a river biome. But they can really be found in any sort of biome, but, like, you know, puffer fish are more common in so and so so biome. Salmon are more common in river biomes. Normal fish are more common in. Normal ocean biomes. Who knows? You know? I went back to a normal ocean. Actually, get out of here. Go to a deep ocean. Oh, and look, I caught a clownfish. Wow, that that was so exciting, you know. And, uh, just quickly see, yeah, I've got about a minute left, and I think I'll end this video on a good note. So, uh, yeah. See you guys, and this was, uh, few biomes and fishing, and, uh, 13W36A snapshot, I believe. See ya.